Hello guys, so finally the CM12 for the OnePlus One was released, rather the CM12S. And in this video, I'll show you guys how to install CM12S using the TWRP recovery. If you guys do not have TWRP recovery, like if you have not yet rooted or flashed a custom recovery on your phone, then do not worry. I have already made a guide on how to flash CM12 on the stock recovery, like completely unrooted phone. I'll give the link of that in the description below. That will be the first link or it will be over here present as a card. Uh, I is the symbol over here somewhere here. Yeah, so you can follow that method if you do not have custom recovery installed. So guys, in this video, I'm going to show you two methods to flash CM12S. The first method will be like if you have CM11S running like me, as you can see, this is the CM11S. And if you want to flash CM12S, then the part one method is for you. But if you have any other custom ROM installed, like if you have Oxygen OS installed or if you have CM12 Nightly's installed, then you can follow part 2 method which will be timelined in the description below or it will be over here somewhere. So let's get into the first part of the video that is how to install CM12S if you have CM11S installed. And I assume that you have TWRP recovery installed and now long press the power button, select reboot, select recovery and hit OK. Now we'll boot into TWRP recovery and we'll flash the Sanusian Mod 12S. And I'll repeat once again that all the apps and the data of the apps will be retained if you flash CM12S on the CM11S build. So as you can see, we have successfully booted into the TWRP recovery. Now first thing you should do is backup the current ROM so that if anything goes wrong, then you can simply restore this backup and you will be on the safer side. So simply swipe to backup and backup the current ROM. And after that, go into wipe then select advanced wipe make sure that you select advanced wipe do not just swipe to wipe and after we get into advanced wipe select dalvik cache and cache select only these two options and just swipe to wipe and as you can see the wipe is completed now simply hit back button and now select install and now select the cm2ls zip file which will be linked in the description below and this is the CM2LS zip file which is TWRP flashable. If you flash the normal zip file, the normal OTA zip file, then it may not be flashed through TWRP like this. So you have to use this zip file to flash through TWRP recovery. So guys, as you can see over here, the zip file is installed. And the zip file installation took a very short amount of time. So that's a good thing. And after this is done, simply reboot system. And it will ask you if you want to install Super SU zip. If you want to root the CM12S, then simply select swipe to install. But if you do not want to root the CM12S, then select do not install and it will reboot into CM12. And as you can see, this is the new boot animation by the Sanusian. And as you can see over here, it's saying that Android is upgrading. And this may take a very long time if you have uh, many apps installed, like if you have around 100 apps installed or 50 apps installed then this may take a little bit of time do not worry just simply sit back and relax the phone will boot fine no worries so guys as you can see over here we have finally successfully booted into the cm12s rom and this is the lock screen so let's unlock the device and let's check the cm12s version and as you can see the theme which i had applied earlier on the cm11s has remained so that means all the data has remained intact and no issues with the data whatsoever and as you can see, this is the Sinogen mod 12.0 wide ng one ta blah, 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 blah. That's a very long name. But this is based on 5.0.2. So finally, the wait is over and you can surely enjoy the CM12S on your device. If you swipe from this side, then notifications will be shown. If you swipe from right side, then it will bring you to quick settings toggle. If you want to see some of the features and tips and tricks of CM12, then I have already made a video on it. I'll give the link of that in the description below. So don't forget to check that out. And you can come to know about many different things which are present on the Sinusion Mod 12 in that video. So don't forget to watch that video. And guys, now let's get into the second part of the video in which I'll show you guys how to install CM12S if you have a custom ROM installed or Oxygen OS installed or if you want to make a clean install of the ROM. So for that, you need to have TWRP recovery installed. So let it be any ROM. Just simply long press on the power button, select reboot and select recovery. Or if there is another method for your ROM, then simply select that method and reboot into recovery mode. So guys, as you can see over here, we have successfully booted into the TWRP recovery. And first thing you should do is backup the current ROM so that if anything goes wrong, then you can simply restore this backup and you'll be on the safer side. Now, as we have custom ROM installed, so go into wipe and select swipe to factory reset. 
this will wipe the data cache and dilute cache so data won't be retained in this method so i suggest you guys to backup the data if you want to take the backup and after the wipe is done simply going to install and now select the cm12 zip and just swipe to confirm flash and now this will flash the cm12 zip file on the oneplus one and you don't need to do anything else other than this so as you can see the installation is done and it was pretty fast after that simply select reboot system and if you want to root the cm12 s then you can select swipe to install or if you do not want to root the system then select do not install it's as easy as that and now we'll reboot into cm12 s so guys as you can see over here we have successfully booted into the cyanation mod 12 s from any other rom or from oxygen os so now let's skip through the setup process and guys as you can see over here this is the cyanation mod 12 s i'll just confirm that by going into settings and if we go into about phone as you can see cyanation mod 12.0 yng 1 ta that's a very long name so this is how you can install cyanation mod 12 s on your oneplus one so if you have stock recovery installed then i have already made a guide and the link is in the description as i mentioned earlier and you can follow any of this method to flash cyanation mod 12 s and it's quite easy But if you still have any doubts, suggestions, queries uh, regarding Cyanogen Mod 12s, then do let me know about them in the comment section below. I'll surely try to answer all of them. And I have already made a video on Cyanogen Mod 12 features, overview of the Cyanogen Mod 12, and various tips and tricks. I'll give the link of that in the description below. So don't forget to check that out too. So this is it for this video, guys. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to hit the like button if you like this video, and don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. Because many more technology related content is surely going to come on the channel, and I have already made many videos on OnePlus One, so you can check that out. And all the video links will be in the description below. So thank you, guys. Thank you for watching.